happy weekend um again with i won't ask and my question is i see women fighting up and down quarreling fighting insulting one another say they don't thief person massa or they don't uh, take person massa or they don't carry woman give person massa the fact is then i say women when i don't know saying we are the ones fighting and almost killing each other while these men sit down there comfortably and they are enjoying the game enjoying you people fight and kill yourselves now this man this man that you say they have stolen or this man that you say they have taken are they dogs like are they are they not dog with they hang rope for neck a dog that you control with 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 a cord on the on the on the truth you carry them around you pull them around everywhere are these people not old enough to take care of themselves why is it that it's a woman that will fight for a man why don't the men fight for the women hmm? why don't they fight now you will be woman now you get power of pass man picking where you won't go fight for her and this men safe do they force them to do what they don't want to do? Cheating, I would say, is a preconceived uh, uh, idea. Not be something where they just meet person today where they go talk, say, eh, they don't come for some. I be the women, do they rape the men? Do they rape them? Because I don't think a woman has the right to rape a man. Now, you like a man, if you go out, or somebody calls you, if you love and respect your wife that you have in your house, hmm? When you even see that temptation coming from afar because we identify it the temptation when it's coming but we don't run away from it because you think you are a superman when you leave a wife in the house who you love and respect eh, and you go out anybody calls you a uh, come oh there is a young girl here or there is an old man there you will tell them no i love my wife she's at home i'll go and meet her you will not be forced to do anything because you are a grown-up man and you have a mind of your own. So nobody should force you to do anything. But the funniest thing about it is that when they go out and they do it willingly, they will fully do it. Nobody said they do force them. They do it with all their mind and body and soul. Then they come back home. Now when the women find out, they begin to fight and kill themselves. Why don't you turn back and ask the man, why did you do it? Why did you accept to be tempted? Because now acceptance, they no tear your clothes. He no come house with clothes and tear up with the, the, or, or the, he was raped. Now say he willfully do it. Some of them, they have those ideas already in their heads. And when they see the opportunity, they jump at it. Yeah, when they see the opportunity, they jump at it. Because there are still some very good men out there that even though a woman stands naked in front of them, they will say, no, I'm not, I will not do. They have the fear of God in them. They love their women and respect them. But those that does not have respect, they will go and do rubbish and come back. And then later women will be fighting and be killing themselves. Say, eh, they have stolen a, a man. They carry my man and give to somebody. Or, eh, eh, wait, 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 they thief my man. Is the man a fool? Is he a dog? Is he being remote controlled? Is he a normal man? Doesn't you, do, do, you know, get respect? Eh? So, ladies, eh? This thing, please. We are going to go to a new year. Before you attack your fellow woman, eh? Go and attack your husband first in the house. Before you attack insult fight whether beat or kill a woman like you go back and ask yourself if the man you have in the house is worth the fight because you people have shown them that you can fight for them and they sit down comfortably they see you being humiliated because if they cared for you they will not do what they are doing but because they don't care for you that is why they go out Doing what they do. A responsible, respectful man 
will never want to give his wife any kind of pain. But if your husband have decided to give you pain, he's not worth stress. Hmm? So let us please stop fighting one another for people who do not care. Yeah? You don't go killing yourself because you are fighting for somebody who does not even have an iota of respect for you. Think about it before you take any step. Fight with him in the house. Ask him why he did it. Why? No respect. No love. No, I don't know. Just ask him. Maybe he has something to tell you. So what I am just saying is that my lady, please, my ladies. Hmm? Fighting, disgracing ourselves. Insulting each other in the name of men. It never help anybody. And eh, not be you, you go help. So please think twice before you take that step that you want to take to go and kill somebody's child because of a man. And if you go there, you don't have strength. The person succeeds to kill you. The man will definitely end up marrying another woman. Yeah? So you guys, it never help anybody. Nobody will go help. Take a easy with yourself.